a file channel object requires a byte buffer object to do both reading and writing. And byte buffer is a helper object that represents a sequence of bytes. So it has this wrap method that allows to populate the buffer with a certain sequence of bytes. For example, if you have a string, then you can call string get bytes, which returns back the array of bytes. And once you have the array of bytes, you can wrap byte buffer and the wrap method returns back the instance of the byte buffer object. So file channel then can write the byte buffer into the file, basically write the memory buffer that the byte buffer contains internally. And the example of this kind of work uh, we have on our Java samples page. Right here, it's called file channel, standard open option, and byte buffer. This is a very minimalistic example of the code uh, that shows how to write an integer into a file in binary form using the file channel. And so first we construct the path. Then we create file channel by calling files new byte buffer. You can see that I'm requesting the modes to create the file and open it uh, in writing mode. Uh, then we have an integer named value. And we would like to save uh, it inside a file in raw format. Basically exactly the same way as this integer is stored in computer memory. Um, and we say that the space to accommodate this integer has to be four bytes because in Java every integer is four bytes. And then we create the byte buffer, which will allocate a memory of this size. And now that we have the memory already allocated, we can say byte buffer put integer value in that memory. So basically the integer is copied into that memory. In order to be able to write this memory a buffer into our file channel, we have to rewind uh, the buffer. Essentially, we have to reposition the pointer inside the buffer to the very beginning. Otherwise, nothing will be written. We need to remember to do this every time we prepared the buffer and now we're getting ready to write this into the file channel so just remember to call this method and then it's pretty simple just uh, write and close the file so this will save this integer inside this file in its binary form